So about 15 years ago, I believe I completely tore my ACL. I actually have never went to the doctors to get an x-rayed, but I'm pretty sure that I did. Uh, I've got this, you know, tendon here uh, over my patella, and then I'm pretty sure I have my PCL totally intact. But uh, I was goofing around one day and I did this like one arm cartwheel side flip thing that I didn't know how to do. And I felt this really big snap in my knee. Like my, my knee wrenched like this, like in this direction, and it just popped. So right after it snapped, um, you know, I was hobbling on it for a while. And then it, you know, within an hour or two, there was just swelling and my, my leg was kind of stuck in this position. And then it took months, even years for it to regain full uh, kind of flexibility and motion. And I just want to share with you, you know, I tore my ACL, I'm pretty sure, um, but I never got it surgically repaired or did any kind of intervention in that way. And I just want to share with you my experience, how it's been. I think it took even a few years before I felt comfortable in wrenching back my knee like this. My legs, for the most part, have felt pretty agile. As long as I, you know, run around and get exercises, um, it feels still pretty good. That said, there's a few things that I just don't feel like I can do that I used to be able to do. For example, I don't feel like it would be wise for me to jump as high as I can very often. Um, one time I did this, uh, this kind of long jump off of a, a swing. I strained my knee pretty bad and it took a few months to recover uh, when I jumped off the swing. And when I landed, it just put a lot of pressure on my knees. Another couple things I've noticed is that uh, if it's cold outside in the winter, that this knee actually kind of aches. It's kind of weird. I feel like I'm an old man sometimes because I have like aching joints, but I have noticed that. Um, I've also noticed that if I don't keep active and running and keeping those muscles, you know, uh, active, then uh, my muscles can kind of feel kind of stiff and my knee can kind of feel not as, as comfortable and as agile and mobile. So I don't know exactly what my knee has done to be able to compensate for the torn ACL. I imagine my PCL has maybe just gotten a little bit stronger and maybe certain supporting muscles have maybe strengthened. I'm not totally sure. Uh, it feels pretty good. I just can't do things like run and pivot a bunch. I can't really pivot very quickly. I feel like if I were to run and pivot really hard on my knee, it could injure my knee worse. Um, I also don't really go out of my way to do super high intensity running, jumping kind of things with my knee. But I have been able to live just fine and I don't feel like it's a huge deal for me. Maybe I'm gonna pay the price a little bit as I get older and my body starts to wear down. But looking back on it, you know, if I could turn back time and if I had the resources to go to the doctors or the insurance to go and get it kind of fixed, however they reconstruct your ACL, uh, I'd probably, I think my knee would probably be better off if I had gotten that. But it's, you know, honestly, my knee has been working great. I am just astounded at how incredible the human body is that even though I snapped a very important ligament that my knee feels normal and 99.9% .9 of the time doesn't cause me grief and works just fine. But I would recommend getting it checked out. I don't know if it was super wise that I didn't get mine checked out, <laughs> but I'm just grateful that the human body is as amazing as it is. Uh, thanks for watching this video. If it's helpful, give it a thumbs up, subscribe. We'll see you next time.